Good morning, and it's April the 1st, April Fool's Day, which should be renamed April Humza Day because it's the start of the of the hate bill in Scotland. Uh, it's going to be a very interesting day. We've got three protests outside of um, Holyrood. I think they're starting about 1 p.m. So uh, I'll be watching out for them and see how they go. I hope they get a lot of press. I doubt it in Scotland because the press are very biased. So we'll, we will see. But um, yeah, how many, uh, it'll be interesting to see how the police react to this. How many, uh, whether they be overwhelmed with phone calls on on this uh, on on this day, but whoever thought it was a good idea to enact this law on April the first, I think they've got a they must have a sense of humour because it's uh, not great uh, politically for Humza because he becomes a bit of a laughing stock. He becomes he, he becomes the fool. Uh, so um, not the best of days politically for Humza Useless, but he's a he's a shockingly poor politician at the best of times anyway. So, but yeah, it's going to be a very interesting day. I'm watching out for the protests. I'm watching out for whether we hear if the police are overwhelmed with this. Uh, so the first couple of months are going to be very interesting. But I don't think it, I don't see how it can survive this this law. It's a shockingly poor, poor poor law. Shuts down freedom of speech, as we spoke before. It shuts down uh, media, and it shuts uh, an attempt to shut down uh, politicians, uh, the opposition. We've seen that with Murdo Fraser uh, before this even started. He's been reported to the police. And he's going to take it further. He's uh, he started to uh, get legal advice, and he's going to take this all the way. And good luck to him, because um, it'll be interesting to see how this goes in court. Because um, when it's challenged, and it does need challenged, so uh, good luck to Murdo on this. And um, well, that's my rant for this morning, April the first. April Humza Day, as it's going to be known from now on in Scotland. So um, I'll uh, that's me finished for this morning. Uh, please subscribe, leave your comments, tell me about uh, Humza and what you think of this hate law and what you think, um, are, are you going to be making any kind of complaints? Because I can imagine it works both ways. The opposition are going to be uh, made uh, complaints about the opposition but it's also going to be a lot of complaints about Humza and the SNP politicians. So um, watch this space. Uh, so that's me. So have a good, have a lovely day, and uh, I'll speak again. Goodbye for now.